Well, after thick black smoke was seen billowing from its chimney, New York State has now suspended and issued violations against the Amagon crematory in the town of Tonawanda. Now, because this is not the first time it's happened, local officials say they hope this time it's the last. Our top story tonight from Two on Your Side's Leanne Stuck. The New York State Department of Environmental Conservation has served a notice of violation to the Sheridan Park crematory at the Amagon Funeral Home on Sheridan Drive. This comes after this photo showing thick black smoke billowing from the facility was taken by Town of Tonawanda Councilwoman Shannon Patch. I thought for sure I'd be pulling over to call 911 because someone's house or business was on fire. And as I came up the road, I realized that it was coming from Sheridan Park Crematory at Amagon Funeral Home. Today, the DEC confirmed the crematory is in violation of two provisions of its air quality permit and that cremations will be suspended until the investigation is complete. Something Assemblyman Sean Ryan and Councilman Bill Conrad advocated for. I was pleasantly surprised this morning to hear that they took such quick action. It's obviously it's not a good fit for a residential neighborhood. You see what happens when there's big problems. So I think it should be a wake up call to the company to say, all right, we're going to move out of this area and go to some place that's more appropriate, less densely packed than this uh, particular neighborhood in Tonawanda. The DEC released a statement saying in part, Sheridan Park is not performing cremations at this time and should not resume cremations pending DEC's review of Sheridan Park's internal report on last Wednesday's incident as well as the full and complete demonstration that Sheridan Park is employing DEC required and approved corrective measures. Well, they have to do a number of things. They have to prove uh, uh, things from temperature gauge checks now uh, to different regulations, uh, and they have to do a number of hoops now uh, to reopen. The crematory was shut down in 2012 after years of complaints from neighbors and reopened again in 2018. Assemblyman Ryan considers this a victory for those neighbors. Two on your side reached out to Sheridan Park Crematory for their response to the violations. We're still waiting to hear back. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.